Hi, One Hour Smart Home here, and today we're going to compare Simply Safe versus Ring versus Nest home security systems and go over the features of some of these popular DIY security systems. So if you're in the market for a DIY security system, you can understand how they work and some of the differences and features between the three of these smart home security systems. So over here, I have a Simply Safe security system. I've got a Ring security system here and I have a Nest security system here. So all three of these are designed to be DIY security systems that you can install yourself without the need of a professional contractor. And they all offer options for monitoring the system yourself. So if there's an issue, the alarm will sound within your house and you have to call first responders, or they all offer professional monitoring where if the alarm goes off, a call center, an alarm center will then call you to make sure everything is okay. And unless you give them the safe word or confirm that everything is okay, they will automatically dispatch first responders. So I'm gonna start with Simply Safe versus Ring because they have very similar functions when you set them up at first. Both of them have a base station and then both of them have keypads. Here's a Simply Safe keypad. And if you can see it, this is a Ring keypad right here. Now, Nest does have a keypad, but it's built into the top of the base station like so. So Simply Safe and Ring both have remote keypads that allow you to enter the code to arm or disarm the system. And I really like that functionality. Nest, the keypad is built into the base station and you can't get multiple base stations. So that is somewhat of a detractor for the Nest system if you want multiple keypads. Some people, that won't matter. However, the Nest system and Ring system allow you out of the box to arm or disarm your system from your phone. So you have control via the app with Nest functionality and Ring functionality to arm or disarm the system from the app and you don't have to pay for a professional monitoring service to have that functionality. It comes with the system right out of the box. Now, Simply Safe does let you control your system from the app but it requires professional monitoring and that cost is $24.99 per month. And that gives you app access as well as video storage and recording from Simply Safe cameras. That is all included on that $24.99 per month for the professional plan. Now they do have a lower tier plan, which is $14.99 a month, but that does not allow you to have access control and that does not include video recording for your Simply Safe camera. We've got another review on the Simply Safe camera as well, so check that out. And while we're here, just go ahead and subscribe if you want to support the channel. Now the Nest system offers a $19.99 per month professional monitoring plan, but that does require a three year term if you wanna have that $19.99 per month professional monitoring. However, if you wanna do month to month with no kind of long-term contract, $29 per month for the Nest professional monitoring service. And if you want camera recording, video footage recorded 24 seven with Nest cameras like the Nest doorbell or Nest outdoor cameras, it's $12 per month for an unlimited number of cameras at one address, and that gives you 24 seven recording. If you just want recording for when motion is detected on your cameras, you can do an option that is $6 per month. Now, Ring has probably the best deal for professional monitoring and video storage. So for $10 per month, you get Ring Professional Monitoring, just like Professional Monitoring with the Nest or Simply Safe system, but that also includes video storage for an unlimited number of Ring cameras at one address with a Ring alarm system. So the professional monitoring plans for these systems are $24.99 for professional monitoring and the app access and control. The Nest system is $19.99 to $29 per month for professional monitoring. And if you want cameras, you're gonna pay additional for that. The Ring system is $10 a month and that's for professional monitoring and video storage. Now the professional monitoring services and response of all three of these systems are pretty much the same. If the alarm goes off, a call center calls you to confirm the alarm. And if you don't respond or you don't say the safe word, they're gonna dispatch first responders. So let's get into the specifics of the sensors for each type of these systems. 
So all of these systems have a window indoor contact sensor. This is a Simply Safe window indoor contact sensor, and this is designed to be installed right on your window or a door. And if the alarm is armed and that window or door is opened, the alarm will go off. So this is a Simply Safe sensor, but they're all pretty much the same. This is a Nest window indoor sensory contact sensor, works the same way. And the ring sensors, they work the same way as well. Now, ring did do an update recently on their system. So these sensors are a little bit smaller in the newest model of the ring device. But really all ring did there was update the exterior plastic for those ring pieces. The internals for most of the devices are pretty much the same. Now, one unique feature of the Nest window indoor sensor is that it has a built-in motion sensor. So when you buy a Nest window indoor sensor, it has this built-in motion detector, whereas the Ring system and Simply Safe both use separate motion sensors. So it's nice to have a combined sensor. However, this means that this sensor is a higher price sensor typically than the Simply Safe sensors or the Ring sensors. Whereas Simply Safe and Ring use separate motion detectors, here's a Simply Safe motion detector and a Ring motion detector is somewhat similar to that. So Nest really has just this one sensor that works with the Nest security system and that's the basis of the alarm system. So the Simply Safe and Ring systems both have a wide variety of sensors. I'm just gonna go down the sensors that the Simply Safe system has. You got the base station, you got the keypad, we have a motion sensor here, window and door sensors, but they also have a panic button sensor. They have a key fob sensor right here and you can arm or disarm your system right here from the key fob, as well as it's got a panic button on the top. This is one of my favorite features of the Simply Safe system. And I wish both Ring and Nest had a little keychain key fob like this where you could just press a button and arm or disarm your system, but they do not. However, they both have other features that work really well, but this is a nice little feature, this keychain key fob, so you can easily arm and disarm your system. The Simply Safe system also has auxiliary sirens, smoke detector sensors, carbon monoxide sensors, a flood sensor, a temperature sensor, and a glass break sensor. So a wide variety of sensors there with the Simply Safe system. The Ring system has many of those same sensors. You get a window and door sensor, you have a base station, auxiliary keypads, you have a motion sensor, you have flood and freeze detector sensors, you have a panic button sensor, you have auxiliary sirens, a smoke and carbon monoxide detector that works with Ring, and you have a smoke and CO listener device that works with Ring, which is a retrofit you put next to an existing smoke or carbon monoxide detector in your home, and it listens for that existing detector to go off, and then it will alert or alarm and communicate with that Ring station if it hears a smoke or carbon monoxide detector. So an interesting way to retrofit your house. Now, the Ring system also has a retrofit kit that allows you to use existing hardwired contact sensors for your Ring security system. So if you have an older security system that is hardwired, you can use this Ring retrofit kit that wires into that existing security system wiring and that connects to the base station so you can use your existing hardwired infrastructure and make it a smart system by connecting it to the Ring base station and keypad with that retrofit kit, which is a unique functionality that neither Simply Safe or Nest have. Now we went through the sensors for Simply Safe and Ring, and the Nest doesn't have a wide variety of sensors. They only have this one singular motion detector window and door sensor. However, there are other Nest devices that integrate in the Nest app that work as a comprehensive system in the Nest app, but they're not connected as part of the alarm system. So you can still view Nest cameras, or your Nest doorbell, or your Nest thermostat, all on one app with the Nest system or use Nest smoke detectors or carbon monoxide detectors, but they're not connected to the alarm system as part of the professional monitoring. So they'll all be on the app, but those other devices can't be used to trigger the alarm. Only the motion sensor window and door sensor can be used to trigger the alarm with the Nest professional monitoring system. Now Nest does have a key fob, but it's not a button type key fob. That key fob can only be used to scan in and out and arm your security system. So you take the key fob and scan over the top of the Nest base station to arm or disarm it. So it doesn't have the functionality like this where you got these three different buttons to arm or disarm or panic button like the Simply Safe system does with the key fob. Whereas with these two systems, Simply Safe and Ring, those other sensors, most of them can be used to trigger the alarm system. So that is a key difference between the three of these systems. 
Now let's talk about the apps for these systems and how they work with smart home control. Both Nest and Ring have full functionality right out of the box with smart home and app control. They both will connect to your Wi-Fi network and let you control these settings and set up directly from your phone, which makes it really easy to set up, customize, and control both of these systems. And you don't have to pay any kind of monthly cost for that. Out of the box, you can do that. So out of the box, unless you're paying for professional monitoring, that Simply Safe system does not have any kind of out of the box Wi-Fi or app control like Nest or like Ring. And I will say Nest and Ring do have really nice polished apps that have a ton of functionality. You can really get in depth with customizing on the Nest app. And if you have Nest cameras or a Nest doorbell or Nest thermostat, they're all gonna populate on that same app. So you really can have one app that has a large majority of your smart home devices if you have a lot of Nest devices all in one place on the Nest app with the Nest alarm system. Now, that doesn't mean if you have Nest devices, you have to get a Nest security system to have a home that is protected by a smart security system. You could go with any one of these. And in fact, I have a mixture of smart home devices in my house and it's really not a big deal. You just click one app or the other and you just move your thumb over a centimeter to click a different app. Now the Ring app has a ton of functionality as well. And one feature that I really like on the Ring app is the neighbors functionality. Basically, it's a community on the Ring app where people with Ring alarm systems or Ring cameras can kind of report what's going on locally in their neighborhood. They can share their camera footage on the app if there's something going on or local events and incidents that are happening in your neighborhood. What I've most often seen the Ring Neighbors app being used for is helping people reunite with their pets that get lost or run out of their backyard. So that's one feature of the app that is kind of unique to Ring that allows you to share your video footage to that local neighborhood community and Ring Neighbors section. Now within the Ring app, you can also arm the system or disarm the system or customize the system or add new devices to the system. So a very easy functional layout of the Ring app. Once again, Nest and Ring really do a great job on their apps and the functionality and intuitiveness of using those two devices. Now, another big difference with Ring and Nest is both Ring and Nest have a wide variety of cameras and video doorbells that work with their systems on that same app. So Nest has several security cameras that connect to that same app. There's the Nest Hello Doorbell, the Nest Outdoor Cam, the Nest Indoor Cam, and the Nest IQ Cam, and a couple other Nest cameras that will connect to that same app that allow you to add security cameras and video recording to your system. So Ring has a very similar setup. There's several different cameras there. There's floodlight cams, outdoor cameras, the Ring doorbell, and indoor cameras. And either one of these have a wide variety of cameras really that you can tailor to your specific needs and usage for protecting your home. So Nest and Ring have a lot of camera options. The Simply Safe system has only a doorbell video camera and they have the Simply Safe camera. We've got a review on the Simply Safe camera here. In this Simply Safe camera, it's meant for indoor use, but you can buy an adapter that you put over it. It's called the Wetsuit and that makes it outdoor compatible, whereas the Nest and Ring systems make specific outdoor compatible cameras that have really good resolution. Both Nest and Ring make some really impressive cameras that give you high resolution. Now, these also have functionality with voice assistance. So the Ring system is compatible with Alexa, the Nest system is compatible with Google Home, and the Simply Safe system is compatible with both Alexa and Google Home. And what you can do with these is you can arm your system using voice commands with any of the voice assistants that they work with. Now, there's not much of a difference in how you use voice assistants with these three security systems. You really can just arm the systems with a voice assistant. It's more about compatibility. So if you have one particular that you're looking for to be compatible with your voice assistant, that's something to consider there. So we've got videos that are more in-depth reviews of each one of these systems. So I'm gonna include links to those below if you really wanna get into the nuts and bolts of each one of these systems. But this is kind of a general overview comparing Simply Safe versus Ring versus Nest. And really what it comes down to is do you want a wide variety of sensors? So if you want a wide variety of sensors, both Simply Safe and Ring offer that. What are you willing to pay for the monthly cost? So here you're $24.99, here you're between $19.99 and $29.99, 
And here you're at $10 per month for professional monitoring. And then I think usability comes into play. So if you're someone that's used to a traditional security system, you probably want a traditional keypad like Simply Safe or Ring Offer. Nest has the keypad, but it's on the device and you can't add additional keypads. I wish Nest had additional keypads, but maybe it doesn't bother you. Maybe you just will arm or disarm the system from your phone. So everybody is different. So I hope you enjoyed this comparison of Simply Safe versus Ring versus Nest. And if you have any questions, please put them in the comments below so we can answer them or share what your experience has been with these systems. So once again, thank you for watching. If you want to support us, please subscribe, click the thumbs up button, and click any of the links below. Thank you.